Subscribe, <laughs> man. West Ham United 1, Manchester United 2, and yet again, an away day for Manchester United ends in complete drama. After going behind, Ronaldo equalises and late on, Jesse Lingard fires in the winner. But let's not forget about the true match winning play by David De Gea, saving Mark Noble's penalty in added time to secure the three points. This was a must win game for the team, but once again I have to say, Manchester United at the moment are first gear and reverse FC, <laughs> mixed in with moments of brilliance, no second or third gear. How many times am I going to come on this and say that we started the game slow and sloppy? But that continued throughout. It seems that United are always waiting to see what the opposition are bringing before actually coming out of their shell and playing some real football. It's concerning and all we can hope for is that as the season goes by and the positive results continue, the performances will too. Now, and I think that will happen. I think, look, tell me what you think in the comments, but I think the positive results will come. And the positive performances as well, because that's what we're talking about. Mm. Getting the performances a bit better. Unfortunately, a lot of people won't believe in that because this has been a constant from last season. Once again, look, I do have to say we must improve to be legitimate contenders. But in the end, we left the Olympic Stadium with all three points, which is what matters in the moment. Ole, his coaching staff, the players must now work on how to control games better but also how to stay engaged from minute one to night make sure that we don't have to come from behind almost every game we must do better and we must make sure that we can open up to second and third gear come on all right listen i get what you're saying but right now i'm hyped the drama in the final few minutes of added time, the 80 plus, oh my, it's crazy. The goal, the save, everything. Listen, West Ham was sitting back and we were pushing, momentum was building, getting closer and closer. And in the end, the man that could have been on the other side today ends up breaking their hearts with an absolutely brilliant strike. Great this strike. It's how you bounce back after making a mistake in the Champions League midweek. And I couldn't be any more happier for Jesse. De Gea as well. Don't get me started about David De Gea. That brother was almost phased out of the club after all the outstanding years of service he has given. Mm -hmm. One tough patch. And everybody was ready to give up on that man. The man that had given everything every time he put on a manchester united shirt even after the fax machine did broke down <laughs> hmm? put some respect on david de gea's name jesse lingard also but that is a statement great win for united and now we can rest then get repaired for west ham again at home this time in the carabao cup they will want to remove the sting of this result but once again, yep. we will be ready and we will win again. Hopefully. These are character building victories. Ones that just, you know, don't just build the confidence of players, but the fan base as well. The more the players gain confidence, is the better they play on the pitch. And the better they play, is the more optimistic us as fans will become. It's all about momentum building in the early parts of the season. And after the disappointment of Tuesday, this is the perfect way to respond. Make sure you subscribe, like this video, everything free, no need for a criminal, mind control, all subliminal, Twitter, TikTok, Insta, digital, join this crew, follow my Twitch and I might rate you, if you pass through ends in this my gang, bust down doors or phase right through.